And we're back with a follow-up review to Van Lu and Ice Cream. First of our two flavors today is pizza. And the second one that we're going to be trying today is Planet Earth. First flavor of the day is the Planet Earth, which has blue spirulina almond ice cream and green matcha tea cake chunks. Thought it was going to taste like dirt. You wanted I don't it know to why. taste like dirt. <laughs> kind of Very excited funny. for it. And spirulina is like seaweed, so. I don't like seaweed. All right, let's give it a go. <laughs> Oh. Very blue dominant. Definitely more of the spirulina almond ice cream. It's accurate to the earth. More water than land. Ooh. Yeah, definitely looks like cake chunks in there. Soft. Yeah. Oh, their ice cream has been very soft. Yeah, it's all like very soft. It's like moon sand almost. Yeah. Or Play-Doh or something. Whoa. Oh! Cotton candy. And that was getting like salty or something, like earthy. Whoa. A cotton candy up front and then almond salty, yeah, yeah. earthy something. Crazy. Extremely creamy too. Yeah, it's like chalky in a not negative way, like clay. Yeah. Super sweet and super like umami. It's really interesting. It's definitely got a very cotton candy flavor at the beginning. Oh, creamy mm. too. No, good start so far, I think. Yeah. Definitely a really interesting one. Not like the mac and cheese one where it's so interesting <laughs> that it's gross, but yeah. it's pizza time. Now for the reason you clicked on this video, pizza ice cream. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm scared. They turned both of my favorite foods into ice cream. Well then. <laughs> How'd the first one go? Bad. And that's putting it lightly. Yes. Some chunks of stuff. <laughs> it really just looks like vanilla with some stuff in it right now. Yeah, like jam or something. It smells suspiciously like nothing but the inside of a pizza box or something. That was weird. <laughs> yeah, I don't even really want to. Gotta get every bite in there. What is that? Crust? Oh, there's there's oh, crust no. in here. Yeah, there's. Okay, yeah. There's like crust <laughs> and tomato jam and all of the horrible stuff that you could put in pizza inside of there, and I'm really not excited for it. If Let's it give it a shot. Not horrible yet. Mm. It's like a slightly savory, like a uh, cheesecake with jam. Well, I'm getting like the crust is definitely a little more umami, but I'm not getting super tomato. No, but I don't think I have a lot of tomato. Yeah. It's better than the mac and cheese. Yeah, it's a lot less <laughs> offensive. Creamy ice cream helps. It's gonna be, yeah, great. Get a little more jam and everything in there, but. It tastes a little like cheesiness. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like the cream cheese it's part. Not bad. Yeah, it's turned out not to the craft extent. Yeah, it's actually really tasty. It's not too bad. Yeah, it's like a tasty, slightly savory sundae. There's no garlic or anything like that. There might be a little bit of like oregano or something in there. Maybe. But that's not really a prominent thing. It's mainly just creamy. Hmm. Suspicious. So I guess they might have actually done the jam and just straight tomato yeah. sauce. That'd be yeah. kind of weird, probably. Yeah, I'm glad there's no pepperoni in here either. Or I don't think there is. Tomatoes are the fourth ingredient, though. Oh, I think it's mainly like cheesy, like yeah. cheesecake. Yeah, isn't? really cheesecake, cheesy, kind of like a salty crust, and then uh, not really even getting a lot of that tomato jam, even though it's listed on the ingredients still have there. Yeah. Overall, it's actually pretty good. Pizza ice cream is more successful than mac and cheese. <laughs> oh, that was better than last week. They didn't just put straight yeah. up pizza in there. Planet Earth was a lot less weird than either of us really expected. Kind of tasted like a normal ice cream flavor, but way better. Enhanced ice cream. You made ice cream into a meal or something yeah. like that. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's some people's meals. That is true. Like I yours mean, on a daily. We don't want to talk about it. I kind of have an ice cream problem, so mixing meals with ice cream was definitely an interesting concept, but one that I think Van Leeuwen definitely lands. I mean, even the mac and cheese one, as gross as it is, they definitely nailed it. It's oh, yeah. Yellow gross cheese with ice cream. <laughs> Anyways, are you guys rushing to Walmart to try these crazy ice cream flavors? Let us know in the comments below. We'll see you next time. Ben and Bev, out! <laughs>